London saw things spice up when all five of the 90s pop supergroup, the Spice Girls, hit the West End's Piccadilly Theatre to launch the musical Viva Forever, which is based on their songs. Writer and star of the TV show Absolutely Fabulous, Jennifer Saunders, penned the story based on the group's chart-topping songs, and Jerry Halliwell, Melanie Chisholm, Melanie Brown, Emma Bunton and Victoria Beckham, who turned up later with her husband, footballer David Beckham, were excited by the result. Amazing! Amazing! <laughs> like, ridiculously excited to see the show. We've obviously been through... We have been there through the whole process, but it's just amazing to see it on stage. Our family's in there. And we've got each other, we got ready together, we've can had a laugh. Can you imagine if you wrote a song in a little studio so many years ago, now the West End cast are singing it? And then all this lot turn up. <laughs> they turn up. They still love us, we still love them, we still love each we other. Love each other. <laughs> we love hanging out, it's brilliant. Brit group The Spice Girls rose to fame in 1994, with their debut single Wannabe released in 1996, hitting number one in over 30 countries. The girls, known as Scary Spice, Sporty Spice, Baby Spice, Ginger Spice and Posh Spice, saw their debut album Spice sell more than 28 million copies worldwide. They have sold over 120 million records globally, making them the best-selling female group of all time. Viva Forever has Judy Kramer at the helm of its production, who is the originator of the hit musical Mamma Mia, based on the pop group ABBA's songs. The show doesn't stray too far from the pop songs at its heart, as it tells the tale of four friends whose bond becomes strained when their band enters a TV talent show and becomes famous. I think people can expect to have a lot of fun, that the Spice Girls was about fun, was about giving confidence to women, was about family. And now Jennifer's written this modern day story, which is set now, and it kind of slightly parodies, you know, TV talent shows, an era that, you know, Spice Girls, would they have actually got through a TV talent show? We don't know, because what the Spice Girls had was individuality and spirit and sass. And that's what we love and what's important. So I hope, I mean, the show is a great story. It's for a family, it's for women, it's full of girl power. The after show party saw the girls celebrate the opening night, although not all critics seem to agree with the standing ovation the production received. Viva Forever's Rise or Fall looks like it may rest on the fans' love of the girl power group.